Hey my denture friends, welcome back to my channel. I just wanted to do a quick review. Many people ask me about Reline It Soft Reliner Kit. It's at home, you can get it for $5. It is cheap, simple, easy to do. Um, I'm not going to do it right now because I've already done it and I will do a video later on, but it is very quite simple. Now when you do this stuff, it's basically almost the same stuff as you get at the dentist, but they charge hundreds of dollars. And my insurance does not cover this, so it comes with two packets. I keep all mine in the freezer. When I pick it up, it goes in the freezer. It says to put it in there for three minutes. I keep it in there until I actually do my soft reline. And this is the Denture Reline It um, Primer. You, It does smell like nail polish remover. But... My sense of smell is horrible, so it doesn't really bother me that much. Plus, I do my nails, so you get used to the smell. But you put this in this tray it comes with, and a little spatula. And you put this in first. Be careful not to splash yourself. Just squeeze it in there, and then you undo the powder. The powder goes right in there with it. You mix it up nice and smoothly. And I don't sit and wait I automatically put it inside my denture. I put it over my palette first, and then I smooth it around the trough and inside, um, make sure it's all even and inside. Then I pop it in immediately. I make sure I have my bite down. I normally press up here and make sure it goes in there nice and tight because I've done this first time and I didn't get my bite down. So make sure you push on it for your bite Bite down, make sure it's correct, and press and hold, which is what I do. And I hold it there for about a few minutes, about four minutes. I take it out, and I just trim with a little nail cuticle scissor around the whole entire thing to get all the excess off. You want nothing hanging over at all. Nothing. You want it nice and clean and all edges cleaned up. Then I put it back in my mouth for a couple of more minutes. And... Doing that, if there's any more that's, you know, couldn't move because the excess was like pushing on something, you put it back in your mouth, you press on it, make sure you got a good, nice, snug fit, let it sit there for a couple of minutes. Then when you take it out, you're supposed to put it in hot water. And after you're done with the hot water, which is uh, about 10 minutes, I think it says in there, it's a few minutes you put it in there. Then you trim out more excess that you need to, make it nice and smooth. And then you could put it in cold water with a teaspoon of baking soda or a half a teaspoon, depending on if it actually works. But that takes out the taste of the primer from the soft free line. And then once you let it sit there for about 10 minutes, I believe it is, um, th there is a packet of information that does come with step-by-step -step instructions. I do the directions a little differently because I've tried it doing their way and it didn't work out so well, so I did it my way. And, like, it tells you to let the, once you put the stuff inside, to let it sit for a couple of minutes, and I don't do that. I get it in immediately, because it does harden pretty quick, even if I have it in my freezer for two weeks. So, once, you know, it's out of the baking soda, it's dried, you're good to go, you just pop it in your mouth, and you're good to wear it. Um, it works great. I've done my soft free line now, I think it's been two weeks since I've done mine, and it's great. I do use adhesive a little bit, just a little bit. Um, for that extra security so when I eat it doesn't do its own thing because sometimes dentures go rogue but I did want to let everyone know what I felt about the Reline It again Reline It you can get pretty much anywhere I mean it's the cheapest at Walmart for like five and change you can get it at Walgreens, Rite Aid, CVS you can get it anywhere um, so try it if it works for you that's great. It saves you hundreds of dollars at the dentist, and it's amazing. I will be trying Denture Fit as soon as when I get my permanent dentures, because I heard Denture Fit was incredible. It's made out of silicone, and it snugs really well. It's worth the money. It is expensive compared to your soft reline kits, but it's made with different stuff, different technology, and it's a nice snug fit. So eventually I will be doing a video for that. But I did want to let you guys know what I felt about the Reliner kit. Give it a shot. It's a good starter. 
especially when you're in your temporaries and you know your gums are still shrinking it's it's worth it it's cheap and if you mess it up it comes with two it comes with two kits for five dollars you can't go wrong with that so if you mess up you have a backup and it will work it will give you that security you need while you're still adjusting to your immediates and wait until your healing period of your sockets filled in where they're not exposed. Do not do it in the beginning. I mean, some dentists have done it, but I wouldn't risk dry socket or anything like that. But if you need the security, talk to your dentist about doing a soft reline early, but I would definitely wait a month before doing it to your immediate dentures. Have a great night all and have a happy denture day. God bless.